everybody, it's your boy Slap Train, and welcome back, guys. This is Forza Motorsport 5, and today we're gonna be looking at the brand new Hot Wheels car pack that came out uh, July the 1st. This got launched. We're bringing it to you a couple days late. I was busy, man. I had plans over the week, so we're getting into it now. Better late than never, you know what I'm saying? So I'm really excited to drive this Lamborghini. You know, I said to myself when I first seen this car, um, this was gonna be the first car that I was gonna drive. We're gonna take this on the ring. See how it performs, how it handles, top speed, this and that. And I really think that this is going to be a really fun car to drive. Now, one big thing that I've not been doing in a lot of my videos is putting on the motion effects as you're driving. Um, I actually just recently found out that that was not turned on. Um, and turning that on has greatly improved you know a lot of my visual seeing as I'm driving you know a lot of the times you know I was like I was like man man I was overshooting these corners I couldn't figure it out and it was because it just wasn't feel like I was going fast and my man destroyers was like you ain't got your motion blur on I'm like oh shit I ain't got it so we're turning it on for this man we're gonna turn it up and let's pick this thing up I'm not gonna pronounce this thing yet because I don't know how to say it so let's see how she says it, alright? Are you ready for this? Because I don't want to screw it up and just hear the comments going down. You know what I'm saying? We got one manufacturer caller. Can we make this carbon fiber block? Oh! You know what, though? I don't think I'm going to touch anything with this. We're going to leave it as the way it says with that gray. Because that gray looks hella damn dope. Oh my god, we got like space on this thing? That's crazy, bro. You know what? No. We're leaving it. We're not touching it. Let's see what this thing's called, man. Come on, girl. I'm gonna say Vienna. Maybe. I, I don't know. Don't be quoting me on this, alright? This is your 2013 Lamborghini Venino. Venino! Damn it, yo. Alright, so it's Venino. Venino, Venino. You know what I'm saying? We got the Lamborghini Venino. Alright, so realistically, what we're gonna do to this thing, first, I just wanna see what we can do to it. Oh, it's all wheel drive. Okay, okay. I was not expecting that. I thought it was gonna be mid engine, rear wheel drive. That's all right, though. That's all right. But now that we know what this is going to be, we're going to throw, you know, you know what, actually, we're going to drive this stock for a little bit, see how it runs. Just we're going to give it, you know, a fair chance of the car and see how it goes. Ladies and gentlemen, I'll see you guys on the Nordschleife. All right, guys. So here we are back on the Nordschleife right now. We have our beautiful Venino ready to go. Thing took a little bit to load up right there, but we have a full lobby right now. I figured we'd do this online. Reason being is that it's going to give us an opportunity to randomize the grid order. So this is a completely random grid order. We're not too sure where we're going to place. I hope we're going to go somewhere in the middle. Um, I'm really excited to drive this Venino. Like I said, this is the biggest car that I wanted to. This is like the cover car for this pack as well too. So I hope you guys are going to enjoy this. We have the beautiful GTE rim on here. You guys can see this with the Thrustmaster TX base. And we have the T3PA Thrustmaster pedals and the Wheel Stand Pro holding it all together, man. So if you guys want to get a setup like this, click in the description box below, man. It's not that hard. It's all down there, boo-boo. Click on it, but I'm excited. We have the volume up a little bit more so you guys can kind of listen to the engine sounds a little bit. Have some fun with it. But guys, I'm excited. This thing is going to be a damn vicious trip. I don't know what to expect. First time driving this, I haven't put any kilometers on there. You guys see me purchase it for the first time. So, I don't know, man. I I'm excited. I really am. I want to drive this thing. We're going to try not to go off the track at all. Um, that's like my main Forza goal. You know what I'm saying? If you had one Forza goal in life, finish the Nord Slifer without screwing up one time. Though. Just one time. You know what I'm saying? All right, where are we right? Back? Oh, my God. They gave us last place. Appreciate it. Baby, we gotta play this smart though. Oh, the braking on this though. Okay. Very strong coming out of these corner sections. Trying to get through these Commodores right now. We are locking up a lot more than I expected with this. Oh, just a little tap, a little tap. Try and get through here. Oh, we're blocked. We're blocked, man. Okay. Appreciate it. Let's go. This thing locks up so easy, man. That is probably my biggest pet peeve right now with this thing. Ooh, look at this third gear rip. Holy 
shit, we fit in there. I cannot believe that we're gonna downshift this. Let's go, baby! Take him on the high side. Oh shit, oh shit. Nothing crazy, nothing crazy. It's a little bit crazy. Let's go, Benito! Where are we in? 13th? Oh my god, we only made up three damn spots. Look at these damn driving tires. What are you doing, man? Go, go, go! We got put in the back of the pack here. We're gonna go through all the damn idiots. Come on! We're gonna cash this little buddy. Ooh. This thing gets a little scary though, I'm not gonna lie. Overall thoughts though, car handles really nice. As long as you're not overshooting these corners, this thing will hold and then pull out of these like a bullet, man. Obviously, it's all-wheel drive, so you have quite a bit of understeer sometimes. But I am surprised, though, that we can't, you know, we can't really uh, fly out of these corners as much as I really want to. I mean, I feel like we could be going a little bit faster. And obviously, we're going to have to give this a second run fully tuned on a later episode because this thing is vicious. But for an S-Class car, though... We are going through everybody. I mean, I am on everybody's ass right now. Oh shit, locked them up a little bit right there. But right there though, I mean, I couldn't turn anymore without oversteering it and just sliding right out. So I mean, this is a very, very difficult car to get used to on the North Life at least. Little bit. Sliding out a little bit. Red lines to the full 9,000 RPM. I like that. Go, Enzo, go. You know what? I'm passing you, sir. Let's go, baby. We got him. We got him. Is that little Brabham up there? Go, baby. No. We're just trying to make it up the pack, man. Come on, dude. Really in 12th right now. Damn, man. I feel like we have gone through so many other cars in that. I don't know why I stopped on that one there. That was brutal. Oh, shit. Scratch my nose real quick, though. This thing definitely does haul, though, on these straights. Here we go. We're getting in there, man. We ain't getting pushed around right now. Don't you do it. I oh, you son of a bitch. Oof. Excuse me. Oh, no, 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 no. We got it. We got it. Hold this third gear. Let's go now. We got this. Maybe not. Maybe not. Oh, our side windows crack now too, man. I'm so surprised on how much force that this braking can really not take, man. That's probably my biggest pet peeve right now is with the braking on this. I am so lightly hitting this pedal, it's not even funny. Carousel time. Look at this, right on this man's ass. The Venino, Nino, Nino, no, is coming. You know what I'm saying? That Venino can't even say the damn word. Going against this VA Commodore Holden. Oh, shit. Let's go. Let's go. Me and you, baby Jesus. Okay, okay. I see I'm not welcome up there with you. This guy is just holding down the entire road, and I cannot get by his ass. Oh, I wanted to take that high side, but I choked, man. I choked. This guy's not giving me any room through these sections right now. This is my mission right now. It's a pass this, man. Come on, baby. Oh, here we go. We got him on the inside. We wait till we screw up, and we're good to go. Oh shit. 
was gonna say, he's not getting back in front of me. I'll drift back onto this track, man. Here we go. It's our time right now. It's our time, man. We just cut that grass ever so slightly. Where you going, baby? Oh, we take him on the high side, though. And here we go. This is our run right now. I don't know why I'm breaking. I, I don't know the capabilities of this Venino right now. We have a lot of understeer in this thing on these higher damn speeds because of the all-wheel drive. Oh, last carousel. Here we go. Oh, we saved it. We saved it. Home stretch. Let's see what this thing tops out at now. Ooh, 150, 160, 170. Come on, Vanino. I have faith in you right now. We're in seventh. Come on. 190. Oh my god, dude, let's go! Awesome ass, man! We have 30 seconds to finish this damn race. We got it. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh, oh shit! We gotta finish, man, in seventh. We got it, we got it. I thought that I could have taken that damn corner without letting off the gas and then braking just screwed up. Definitely, if I was gonna retune this car. If I was gonna retune this car though, um, I think 100% the braking pressure would be turned down a lot. Um, I mean, like I said, as soon as I put my foot on that brake, braking was there. Like, I just move it, just <laughs> done. You know what I'm saying? So, that was really like, look at the brakes. What the hell are those? Look like concrete on that damn thing, man. You know, hopefully, they're not too upset that we damaged the Benino too badly. Um, looks okay. I mean, it's just a little paint, it'll be good to go. But I hope you guys did enjoy this episode, though, versus the ring. And if you guys have any other car suggestions where you guys want to see me take on the Nordschleife, let me know in the comment section below. I'll be looking at them and choosing one for next episode. But um, solid race, though. Had a blast in this Venino. Really, I mean, Lamborghini has made a great car for this. And uh, honestly, I loved it, man. I really did. As I said, my really only big pet peeve with this car was... The actual braking. That was my only problem with the car. Other than that, car was fantastic. Thing looks vicious. So, I mean, other than that, awesome car. We had a great race. Cannot wait to use this car online. Don't forget to pick up your Forza 5 Hot Wheels car pack today on the dashboard. Ladies and gentlemen, you put a slab train. I'm out. Peace.